John's going to show you how to properly break down a cardboard box. Anyway, John. Okay. This is Do It Yourself Network at its best. DIY DW stuff. Wait a sec, John. So I noticed you turn this way. Tape. So I noticed that you cut like that up top. See, I would have cut here across the box. Is that not correct? Why would you do that when you just cut the tape and then bam? So box it's really goes. that simple. Fold in half and my put that in there. Now normally there wouldn't be all this stuff in here. Excuse me, John. There wouldn't be all this stuff in here, but. Bubble wrap is not allowed. They go like this. <laughs> and then, like, so here's another good example. If there's stuff inside of it, you gotta take it out. Because when we just put this stuff right here, this, this box is just like this, right there, the day porter will not pick it up. So what we have to do, we do have to take the stuff out, put it in, and quickly, don't cut yourself. John, can you tell us how often these bins get taken out? Every Tuesday, um, they will come get them, and Wednesday morning they're picked up, they bring them back to us every Tuesday. So, what the complaint is, the day porters are saying that they're having to break down our boxes, they're having to take out our trash. So, we will be getting another bin for us, but uh, that bin will be for any excess. Anything, if they're full, once you break down your boxes and they're still full, anything goes in that extra trash can. When that trash can's full, we'll empty it and we'll continue on our business. So use the two blue bins first and then there'll be another bin that we'll use for the excess overflow that we will be removing ourselves and everyone will be happy. Building manager will be happy, John will be happy, yeah. which is not true because he's never happy. I will be happy. Thank you.